Hey guys, you want boxes like this? Sit back, watch the show. This is all about catching kings out of Ludington, Michigan. Fish number one in the boat. Nice Way to go. Awesome job. Oh, is that, oh that's A-bomb. Yeah, A-bomb. It's a new custom at Captain Chuck's. Yeah, that was a spoon nobody could buy last year because it was sold out 100% of the time. If you're thinking of a trip out of Ludington, one of the things that you want to do first, first crack out of the box is you want to, oh, not rigor, rigor, rigor. Get the net out of the way. Shoot, it was on the slider. He's there, oh, I'm he's on. there. I'm on. Go in front, John. <laughs> One of the things you want to do is go on a boat that's got good equipment and a captain that'll put fish in the boat. Captain Mark has got us on fish. Yeah, I know, I'm watching. No, he's coming this way. I'm just gonna hold him right now. Shoot. I'm gonna just try to keep him high in the water, Bo. I got her on the surface. Give me that. It's turn, turn, Bo. I got maybe a chance at it right You're here. You're good. Here, Bo. Coming at the boat. Coming at it, coming at it. He's got it. Mallory, keep pulling to your right. Good job. There we go. Trying to talk to you about quality equipment, quality charter captains, and a quality port. We're here today with Captain Mark Williams on Silver Addiction out of the Port of Lundington, one of the most prolific stops anywhere on Lake Michigan. Here we go, Mallory's fish is coming in. Brett will show you that. Wind down, wind down, wind down. Lift, back up. Oh, that's a big one, Mal. <laughs> <laughs> that is a big fish any day. Oh Good my job, gosh. Mallory. Holy cow. Woo! <laughs> well, Jason, you might have to help her here. <laughs> she said she's been working out for a reason. Well, that's the reason right there. Pickled sunshine fly. Fish number two, fish number three. Good job, Mallory. Biggest fish of the day so far. Fisherman's Digest is brought to you by Angler Quest, built with purpose. Traxtech, the ultimate fishing system. Strike King, tie one on. Garmin. We all want to keep moving, and we all need fuel to do it. Now, with the revolutionary Flow Fast system, you can fuel up and keep moving from literally anywhere. Flow Fast will pump or siphon an amazing eight gallons per minute so you can get back to what you do best. To find out more about Flow Fast, 
Go to flowfast.com. Flowfast. Fuel up. Keep moving. Rigger, shoot rigger, rigger. Jason, Jason, you got it. This one's usually going to be a nasty one. So we got a triple going on right now. As you can see, the back of the boat is pandemonium. So we got Sandy's boats close, uh, fish is close. Mark or Bo is going to have to hand over hand this because they've got a long lead on a diver. Jason, Jason's just on the surface jumping and flipping. We have no idea what Bo's got. I mean, Kale's got. He's got something on but his fish has stayed down the whole time. So this is just craziness. Thank you, Dad. Yeah. Awesome job. Woo! Well, where's the needle nose? Oh, look at this mess. Careful behind So what you. we're running here, well, uh, she wrangles the fish in. We've got a really nice spread of boards, high and low diver, corner riggers, and a shoot rigger. And why that's, you can run that on a big boat where you have to have enough beam in order to be able to get the three riggers down the chute. But the reason that's so effective is because you can put so many different baits at, at, at depths and then Mark at the helm can call out numbers when he sees fish that are marking. We can pull riggers up or drop them down to them. Can't really do it with the divers. They're not that reactive that quickly. But these three riggers can really be adjusted to be able to go right to a fish we mark and catch those fish. The other day, Mark told me they marked two fish clearly, moved the riggers to them, caught them both. Super effective, and that's one of the reasons that you have to have co cooperation and communication between the helm and the back of the boat. Bo back here is a very, oh, he's jumping now, very experienced mate, and that coordination between the captain and the mate is critical. Oh, nice king. Well, the fish actually cooperated. Walk back. Yeah. Way to go, girl. Sand. Woo! Another big one. That's a really nice one, too. Good job. I got you. So we're out here in Lake Michigan, just south of Bloodington, and these spring kings have really showed up nice for us today. I've actually been here since roughly Mother's Day. Um, unknown fishery here in Ludington that people skip over because they always love the fall fishery in the July and August is the spring fishery. And our fishery here from Mother's Day to Father's Day usually has a nice bunch of kings. So if you can get up here and the weather cooperates, it's nice, no flies, no heat. It's just a nice time to get out and catch some fish with our charter captains here in Ludington, the Ludington Charter Boat Association. Uh, does a great job with plants. We just released uh, 100,000 kings and 50,000 coho fingerlings last week, so that's a good reason why they stay. So if you get a chance, we'd love to have you. And if you'd like, you can get with us at silverdictioncharters.com out of Ludington. We'd love to have you. Uh, Bo on the back deck is one of the best on the lake, and uh, we'd like to take you for a trip. This is a big fish. Look at the way he's sharking way back there. Good job. Smooth and easy, Jason. Oh yeah, keep him coming. Job, Jay. <laughs> Thank you, man. I gotta show the spoon a minute. So we've been pulling the different mix of uh, Dreamweaver spoons. Look at this fish, Jay Scott, right there. Silver addictions, where it's at. That's right. Fisherman's Digest is brought to you by Polar Craft. 
the toughest built aluminum boats bar none. Dreamweaver, home of the revolutionary spin doctor. Lose, feel the difference. Wave Pro, best ride on the water. Wave Pro high performance boat pedestals eliminate bottoming out and back jarring impacts. Now available the 2.0 version and slider seat hubs. The best in air shock technology provides a controlled return to keep you on your seat. Fast and easy to install with permanent mounts or movable hubs for quick and easy seat placement in 10 to 16 inch models. Wave Pro high performance boat pedestals, best ride on the water. Online at waveproshock.com. We're still in the month of May, guys. Anybody who thinks you gotta wait till the middle to the end of summer to come here, dead wrong. This might be the most comfortable time of the year to come because we're not spitting bugs out in your face. Not that there's always bugs, there's lots of times where you get a little, just enough breeze to keep the bugs down. But at this time of year, the water temps being in those mid to upper 40s, it just keeps the temperature on the lake down and it keeps the bugs under control. It's one of the best reasons, biggest reasons, a lot of people prefer to come early in the season to these Western Lake ports. So, you know, Ludington is an awesome spot. One of the reasons I love Ludington is it's kind of dead in the middle. It, you know, you got that far Southern ports that offer phenomenal coho fishing. And as you move up the Western shoreline, you, you can go either way out of Ludington. You can go North, you know, to Big Point, you can go south towards Pentwater, and that whole stretch of water from basically the middle of May all the way until, oh, middle of September, well, until they run up the rivers in early September, that's gonna be filled up with nice sized kings. And the fisheries guys, and hats off to Jay Wesley for doing a great job of placing fish throughout the course of the, of the system to make sure that we're always seeing, you know, you know, really good numbers. They've been increasing those numbers. That's good news for everybody. So the success rate on these kinks is gonna go up in the future. Got it. He's gonna change his mind. Huh? There we go. I didn't put Wind it to back him, in for a reason. Wind down to him. There you go. Woo! There you go, Kale. Jeez. Good job, John. He went right back at it. <laughs> So hey guys, while well, Mallory milks this one in, <laughs> let's talk about the great tr products Traxtex has. You know, on my regular boats, my 20 Polar Craft and my Angler Quest, we have the same setup that this great big beautiful 38 Tierra's got. And this is the beauty of Traxtex, it's the versatility. Whether you're on a 20 foot multi-species boat or whether you're on a 40 foot you know, 38 foot Tierra, 40 foot, 45 foot, whatever your boat is, Trax Tech Systems fits perfectly and does everything you need it to do. Of course, we've got our double holder for the slider and uh, then we've got the GT 100s. Now he's got it rigged right here for a triple set, which would be a high, mid, low. We're running just high and low right now. And of course our trees, a quad set of trees. Super important guys. A lot of people get three trees, uh, a, a triple tree. I'd always suggest you get the quad tree. If you don't use that top one, no big deal. It acts as an extra rod storage spot. And of course you can modify these trees with all of your cup holders and tool holders you want. 
So the Trax Tech system is not only the best quality rod holder system and trolling full component trolling system in the industry, it's very versatile and it's, you know, you can, you can modify it to be exactly what you want. Lighter fish bow? Yeah. Yeah. He was a good job, Mal. Leg trout. Slow down a little bit. So, guys, while I'm bringing this fish in, one of the most critical things that you get when you get an experienced charter captain is knowing which directional troll is the best for each day. And I tell you what, very quickly we figured out that the start troll angle of the day was the right one because when we started to turn and go back into shore, the bites literally stopped. So it's super, super important. That's one of the things you get when you get uh, a better quality charter captain. The guys at the that are out of Ludington are veteran captains. Mark's a veteran captain. We got an awesome mate here, Bo. But one of the things that you have to pay attention to when you're booking trips is, you know, read the reviews. Do you got a guy who knows what he's doing? And, and these guys up here out of Ludington typically know what they're doing. Another really nice laker. That's a nice one. Fisherman's Digest is brought to you by Offshore Tackle Products, FlowFast, world's leading portable fluid transfer system, Drato, catch and release boat system. Make loading and unloading your boat easy with the Dorado catch and release automatic boat latch. Load with ease, simply drive on the trailer and the Dorado will automatically latch to your bow eye. A hard plastic liner protects your boat. For launching, back your boat in, pull the release lever and away you go. For roller or bunk trailers, the Dorado is quick and easy to install and works with most V-hull boats. Spend less time at the landing and more time fishing. The Dorado catch and release automatic boat latch, online at doradoproducts.com. Acting like a co-host. I mean, I'm just... Point your rod at it, Mel. What? Point your rod at it. Got your coho. Coho or king? Uh, White mouth. Looks like little king. Little king. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Hey guys, thought we'd stop for a second and show you the types of uh, baits that we were using today. So obviously, whenever you're pulling coppers or lead, you're gonna want a good set of reliable boards. Uh, when you're hunt running heavier coppers, like 250s plus, then you're gonna want the big mag board. If you're running 200s or less, or up to 10 colors of lead, you can go ahead and run the small one. At 10 colors of lead, I actually will run this bigger one. I usually push this one through seven colors. So 10 or 200 copper and above, I'm gonna go ahead and run the big board. So let's talk about these specific baits. Now down the chute, which was absolutely fire today, we had a 10 inch Dreamweaver or 11 inch Dreamweaver paddle. This is just white with a little bit of UV reflective tape, kind of looks like AO Wife on it. And this is a pickled sunshine fly. Now this fly and paddle combination on the chute rigger was money. I bet it caught five of the 15 fish today. Uh, we did most of the other damage on the boards 
different sets. It seemed like we caught a fish literally on everything other than the 300. I don't know if we caught one on the 300. So let's go through some of the spoons. These are really, really good spoons for anywhere on the western part of Lake Michigan. This is called A-Bomb. Uh, it's a really, really effective spoon. It's UV, the red hook indicates UV. This is spotted blue-green dolphin. Uh, again, a UV bait. Standard size Dreamweaver, not Magnums, not Super Slims, just standard size. This is a UV Rasta Goose. And this right here is uh, Blue Jeans. And those four baits, if you run those four baits basically any time of the year, uh, it isn't just situational to spring, summer, fall. These baits are traditional baits that will catch fish. Blues, greens, UVs. Uh, Rasta Goose has been around for a long time. These are all blue, spotted blue-green dolphin a long time. These are all baits that are good, proven fish catchers. If you're looking to increase your catch, go right ahead and integrate those into your game plan. Now the Rasta Goose, I just noticed the UV Rasta Goose is a super slim. So one of the reasons super slims work really well in the early part of the season, of course, a bait grows as it lives throughout the course of the season. So I have really good success running super slims when the bait profile are small, especially early in the season through June. Not bad right now. It's awesome. Wind right down to them, Kale. Yeah, Kale. Another yeah. spring king, perfect. That might be a coho. White mouth. No, it's... Guys, that's number 14. We're hoping for one more. We got a 15 minute time clock running. Kale's putting 14 in the box. 12 kings, two Lakers. Show off that box. That is a box. Hey guys, John Bergsman here, Fisherman's Digest. This was the Motley Crew today. We had an awesome day here on Silver Addiction out of Ludington. Thanks for joining us. As you can see right there, this boat catches fish, this captain catches fish, and this port has got tons of kings. We'll see you next week on Fisherman's Digest. Closed captioning is brought to you by Wave Pro. Best ride on the water online at waveproshock.com.